Family, what's going on? It's your podcast mentor, Jonathan Jones. And I want to let you know this, okay? Don't rush your business. Do not rush your business. I see too many entrepreneurs scoreboard watching. They're watching everybody else in their industry, and then they see them getting the big checks, and they see them getting the call to speak. They see them closing high-ticket clients, but you don't know what those people did to get there, okay? So I want to let you know right now, stop scoreboard watching. Because when you watch the scoreboard, you're looking at what everybody else is doing in their business, but you don't know the marketing plan that they have in place. All right. So stop focusing on them and start focusing on you and your business. And what can you do today to make sure that you can move your business forward? Is it focusing on marketing? Is it focusing on content? Is it focusing on nurturing your audience? Because when you do those things, you'll make sure to grow in due season. Family, what's going on? It's your podcast mentor, Jonathan Jones. And uh, one thing I want to just challenge you on, if you're a new entrepreneur out there and you're trying to figure out why people aren't buying your product, why people aren't signing up for your email list, this might be why, okay? Just like before you uh, get into a house, right? You, you get everything set up, you sign the papers, then you buy the house, okay? But then after you've made the initial investment, made the down payment, then you're able to take out equity and take out value of that house. It works the same way with your potential clients. We need to make sure that we first invest in them value, first invest in them time, in making sure that we're teaching them something and educating them, and then they'll be more likely to sign up for your newsletter, more likely to buy your course, your program, whatever it might be. All right, so try that out. Let me know how it goes. It's your podcast mentor, Jonathan Jones. Is your business ready for a rainy day? How do we prepare for a rainy day in our business? You need your authority umbrella. What falls under the authority umbrella? The first part would be credibility. Are you putting out content that will make you credible and it's honest and true content? That's the first part. The second part is we need to make sure that as our content is being put out, we're putting it out consistently, which is now going to help us build and increase our influence. And when your influence grows, so will your demand. And when the demand grows, you can now increase the price within your business. Family, are you prepared for a rainy day? If not, assess your business and make sure that the three pillars under the authority umbrella are tight, right? Don't raise your prices just yet. Here's why. Here's why. We're in a time where everybody is either trying to sell their product at the lowest fee possible, and some people still aren't buying, and then there's some people that are selling the highest of high ticket items, and other people still aren't buying. Well, John, where am I supposed to be? I, I want you to figure out this. First, I want you to figure out what you're selling to people. If you aren't clear on what you're selling to people, and you're not aware of the problem that you're solving, then you're just throwing out a problem and then just throwing out a price, all right? So we wanna first get clear on what is the transformation that we can create for our clients, and then once we identify the transformation, begin to assess what is that transformation worth? What's going on, family? It's your podcast mentor, Jonathan Jones. And I want you to do this, okay? I want you to do this. Stop trying to steal everybody else's marketing strategy. I know you've seen somebody over here run the birthday play, but you might not have the following that they, that they have. And then over here, you see somebody running the 1997 product, but you might not have that large of an email list, so that might not work for you. Identify what is the specific marketing plan that will work best for you in your business, where you are right now, and stop trying to follow McDonald's and Amazon and everybody else and just do what's true and authentic to you right now in your business. It's your podcast mentor, Jonathan Jones. Take care. We'll talk soon.